We're building a new combined cycle plant here at Paradise to replace units one and two over the coal plant. And, and those plants are being closed in 2017 due to the, the new regulations that have come out with match rule. The cost of ownership, the cost of building the emissions controls to comply was greater than building the combined cycle. The, the three-on-one combined cycle configuration like we're building here at Paradise is very flexible because it allows us to operate anywhere from a, a single combustion turbine operation up to and including three-on-one operation, which is three combustion turbines operating along with the steam turbine. Well, the, the combined cycle plants in the, in the TVA fleet help us to meet the intermediate generation load. This is the load in between the base load power generated through the nuclear plants and the larger coal plants and the smaller peaking sites that are used to, to meet the peaking loads. Overall, our budget for this project, including plant, transmission line, and all of the engineering and material is $1.12 billion. Right now, we are trending slightly under that budget and hope to be more under by the time we finish. This plant will benefit TVA from the aspect it'll provide very reliable, very flexible power to the grid for dispatch. It'll be the most efficient plant that we've built to date.